YouTube land, what's up? It's your girl, my from Cougar's Closet. How y'all doing today? Y'all, I had to give me a little rest. I feel a little bit better. I've been going to bed kind of early lately, like 5 o'clock or 7 o'clock. And then I wake up about 8 or 10, and then I go back to bed again. That's I've been coming home and hitting it hard out there on the ranch, and uh, what else I've been doing? Oh, God, trying to keep up in here and falling off with that, you know. God, I've got so much crap going on in my life. Y'all can't never get my my bridge game together. So, what I am doing here, I am doing a reading for the month of December. Yes, I am into December already. This wind has hit me in the cracks of my tail. So, that that's what I'm doing. I'm just... Oh, God. Oh, I'm sorry. Let me push that down right quick. I have a little something going. Okay. So, let's see what's going on for the month of December. All right. So, I have pulled the King of Cups. Okay. And so, with the King of Cups, right, this is a king that's well protected. But for some reason, I get the feeling that he doesn't think he's protected. The look on his face, I don't know if y'all can see that or not. I don't know, because it looked light to me. Okay, there we go. The look on his face, um, it has two looks on it. The, the, the outside look is clever but the inside look is worried somebody been worried and this can be i'm dealing with energy so this this can be a man king uh women can be kings too yeah don't let them fool you they underground they shade tree kings but, um, you worried about something, right? But even though you worried about something, it's getting ready to come to a halt. It's getting ready to come to an end here, starting December. Now, I don't know about what time the magic is going to begin in December, to be honest. I'm too weak to pull for the energy tonight, forgive me. But, in the month of December... Things that you have been worried about or been trying to get a hold to, they're going to start, you're going to see them starting to slowly die off. And I say that because you have these gold cups in your hand. There's some type of reward going on with these cups here. There's some type of uh, a, a celebration of, of making it to the next level. So, so you've been worried about something, and I don't know why, but this thing plagues you a lot. Let's see if I can pull. Okay. So, what it looks like to me, I pulled two of cups. Somebody uh, is worried about maybe like they love life, uh, they 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 social life. But it's more of, to me, I'm pulling energy of a partnership rather than a business or a contract or an option or something on the table. I'm pulling more of a relationship because there's a couple standing there. So I don't know whoever I'm talking to. If you're in a relationship, well, well of course you're in a relationship with someone because they're standing there. Or, or a friend or whatever, you know, something that this person... um is to you, maybe the relationship has been in trouble for a while, or you are reuniting because uh, 
you lost them the first time and you don't want to lose them again. I don't know what this this meeting of these two are, but I know it, it, it's something uh, heavy with one another because they are coming into union. So, are, are, and some of them are in union already, but maybe there has been a stress uh, on your relationship and it's been running off into your social life, but out in the daytime, you have a clever look. People, they see you, and they don't know that they're looking at cleverness. They don't know what they're looking at. But they know you're clever. But they don't know that's clever, that they're describing what they're seeing, if that is ringing a bell for some. I, I don't know. King of Wands. So with this King of Wands, this tells me that you you will fight. You have something pr to protect about this union. I don't know why. I think this is a couple that's really been through the ringer. But you are... A king that's ready to protect this union, you will go to war for it. Next card I pull is the Queen of Wands. Okay, so with the Queen of Wands, this lady here, maybe, uh, you cut her a raw deal, I'm thinking. Like, maybe you, uh, in the past were cheating on her, or maybe you're previously cheating on her now, and she could have left you. She, she went away, uh, to get her thoughts together. Because, see, now she's wondering why you're coming back around, because she's the queen of wands. She got something to protect, too. Everybody looking around, trying to see who won what. So I feel like maybe you and this person had broke up, but now y'all coming back into union. Y'all had to maybe go y'all separate ways for a minute. The King of Wands and the Queen of Wands. Maybe y'all had to go y'all separate ways for a moment to to understand that y'all loved each other. And it and this is a phase. It took years. Y'all went through what y'all went through. Divorces, marriage, or, you know, never been married, can't find the right one, sleeping with everybody, drinking, probably. Y'all went through whatever y'all went through without e with, with each other not being around. It's kind of like one was on the East Coast and one was on the West Coast. So y'all had to go in, both of y'all, on y'all own time and develop self-worthiness and self-understanding and, 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 and get familiar with the games that people play in, uh, on each other in, in this love field, in this, in this battlefield. So now y'all have grown up and either y'all are connected and y'all have problems and y'all worked them out or either it's somebody you about to connect with and this is how y'all be when y'all come together. Y'all be the king and queen of wands. Both of y'all got some to protect. But at the same time, y'all love each other. Mates in heaven. Th th this hasn't really been an easy journey on both sides. Both had to go off and one was forced to go off to find out there was nobody else in the world or, or could do you better than what you already had. Yep, the fool. Somebody was a fool here. They they played with their relationship. They just set about a journey, and, and they looked at everything they wanted, and they, they slept with everything they wanted, and, and they came home whatever they wanted. They, they didn't care about what they was putting the queen through. They they was just out on an adventure. 
La, 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 all in anybody's bedroom. And the queen broke. That's what happened. Two of Pentacles. So with the Two of Pentacles, this means something is in action and it's getting ready to move forward. Some type of maybe reward, maybe some type of bonus, maybe some type of lost paycheck. Something's getting ready to rule in your favor. It doesn't always have to be money, but that could be the physical form of it. It, it, it in the spiritual world, you might get some type of uh, rich download or something, or some type of idea, some type of something that sparks a, a, a flame to your future invention or something. Next card I pull is Six of Cups. So with the Six of Cups, this tells me that this relationship is now harmonious. Yeah. And the fruits of the labors are starting to roll in now. Because there's flowers coming out the cups. Remember those pictures I had been showing y'all earlier? Those were empty cups. But now you see flowers and greenery coming out the cups. And, and it's like... More like a sacrifice. It, it looks like she's bringing something... You know, like to an altar, like sacrificing. So, whoever this is, y'all have sacrificed a lot. Y'all right now are sacrificing a lot. A lot of y'all are in the midst of sacrificing. It's like you starting to understand uh, your higher being. And you, you understanding that now to get where you want or to be able to go where you want to go, you have to break down for somebody. It, you 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 starting to understand roll now. You starting to understand roll call now. You 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 starting to understand now that you got your foot on these people backs. You start all oh, you starting to see it. But you know it's a certain hand you got to play. And, and, and you've never played this hand before. But see, what they don't understand about you is you in between the lines. You ain't outside of them. You in between the lines with them. They didn't know that. So so, so there, 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 there's been a lot of sacrificing going on where you couldn't see how you would, you know, Cuss somebody out 25 years ago, 10 years ago, 15 years ago. If they had caught you, damn it, three years ago, you would have showed them how to shake and bake. But I get here as, as this king and queen in the middle of growth for both of y'all. Um, Y'all at a spot where... Reality is dead in y'all face. Like I said, some of y'all coming into union. 
some of y'all haven't came into union, but it's about to come into union. Some of y'all gonna get a random choice of of, of union. Somebody gonna just come from out of no dagum. We're whirlwinding out of the clouds. But you've been dealing with sacrifice. I don't know if you had to sacrifice some things for this relationship, for this marriage, for this union, for this proposal. If you had to make some arrangements, if you had to move some things around, if you had to break some hearts, if you couldn't sign on the dotted line. I don't know what this was about. But you had to sacrifice and move some things around. And some of you, if you haven't started, come December... You gonna be sacrificing and moving things around. Watch me work now. Watch me work. Watch me work now. Watch me twerk. Watch me work now. Watch me work. Watch me twerk now. Watch me twerk. You know. Yes. The next card I pull. Is the Six of Pentacles. Okay, so with the Six of Pentacles, right, it's the same ordeal. All this money, all this fortune, and it's going to be some fame in there for some. And, and, and this could be a Libra energy, Pisces energy, a couple of people, Capricorn energy. I want to say Scorpio energy. But it would be a cusp Scorpio if I did. It wouldn't be a full-blooded Scorpio. It would be a cusp Scorpio. But you got some things in December. Like, it's it's going to be like uh, outside of the money, right? You're going to notice that your money growing and everything, you know. Everything going to be good on that side. But you're really trying to enrich, like, your top side, right? But you're going to notice, like, this is what you're going to notice in the month of December. You're going to notice, like, old questions that you was dying to get answers for. You could never get them. Ten years ago, two years ago, a year ago, six months, three weeks ago. I don't know. That's too fresh. But, like... Questions down memory lane that you had a hunch about or, or or questions that you asked and they didn't get answered or are you crazy? You going to have an awakening to where these things are, you going to be able to go back where things didn't make sense, where it was abstract and make it make sense. The, the piece is just going to fall in your lap like the the, the lamp just going to go over in the corner. You know what I'm talking about? Like, like the bookshelf just going to go in the middle. You know what I'm talking about? The, the fireplace going to go in the living room. You understand me now? The the, 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 the the cashmere rug going to be on the floor by the bed when I step my feet down and into my soft slippers, silk satin slippers, you understand me now? It's like, you're you going to have, and this is for both energies, you just going to have this new awakening about life and how you want to do things and like like you still transitioning you you'll never stop transitioning as long as you still moving and you active you'll never stop transitioning transitioning is the shadow is the energy that's pushing behind you is the is the power union you'll never stop transitioning so you are going to be, for the month of December, running into to, to getting all the answers that you wanted. 
like pictures going to play out in front of you, like the hunch that you had or the feeling that you had when you felt like something wasn't right, but you couldn't make sense of it then. For the month of December, you're going to be able to make sense of it now. You're going to be able to do it, baby. Oh, you're going to be able to do it? The last card I pull is the Eight of Cups. So with the Eight of Cups, as you can see, somebody is clearly on a journey in search of something. They they talking to the moon and the moon talking back. They talking to the mountains and the mountains talking back. And they got all these cups here, but they... They ain't really worried about the cups. They didn't left the cups behind. They 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 said they catch up with the cups, you know, on another level. The cups is 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 they there and they go, but they ain't full. They ain't ready yet. They ain't they ain't generating. So with this person right here, and I could say this could be a Sagittarius, could be could be a fire sign because of the red cloak. With this person right here, I feel like you a person that's that's rich in your mind and and you can't understand why things are moving so slow for you like you know you got you know you got like some type of product. You know you got some type of wardrobe line or some type of idea that's that's gonna that's gonna blow the world. You know you got this. But you ain't really been able to run up on the connections. See, these is all cups, but they all ain't filled. They gold cups, but they 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 ain't filled. I mean, it's like you wealthy in the mind, but you might not be wealthy in the pockets yet. So, I'm picking up as you walk you in the midst of conflict. But the conflict is... You battling with certain imprisonments in your mind. Like if you could erase the dark time, you would. If you if if you could erase night time, you would and trade it all for light. Like and don't get me twisted. Like you got these cups here. You very deserving. But at the same time, you battle that you don't feel like you deserve it. So whoever I'm talking to, you could be getting out late at night taking uh taking uh walks. You could be getting up at two or three in the morning, running and jogging. So if you getting up at wee hours of the night, jogging to uh, ten o'clock at night, twelve thirty at night. And you got reflectors on this and that. That tells me that uh, you are dealing with a lot of stress. Somebody is. You you got stress to burn. You can't even sleep. Won't nothing do it for you but a jog and a shower. So, I'm not a fan of the nighttime. Because a lot of things go on at nighttime when other people are asleep. So, who, whoever you are, getting yourself cleaned up is a part of this sacrifice. This is a journey that you have to be on, that you can't bag up off of.
like a lot of y'all are starting to become into becoming the chosen ones for whatever you were chosen for. But but what I can say is this is the beautiful hand here. There, I didn't see. I ain't gonna say I seen I seen nothing wrong, but I de I do see a lot of struggle for the month of December. I I see a lot of uh breaking down, um, tearing down. To build back up come the month of December. Only thing I seen was struggle. You're going to struggle a bit for the month of December. And you can struggle in all ways. Mentally, financially, spiritual, physically, whatever. Like 3D, 5D. 11G, listen, you can struggle all type of ways. It's going to be some type of struggle for the month of December. But let me say this. It's going to be a struggle that sets you free. I don't, Listen, I, I don't know what your struggle is. Only you know what your struggle is. It's going to be a struggle that sets you free. Maybe it was something that you struggled with. So the, so for the month of December, you're going to be dealing with struggle. And you're going to be dealing with sacrifice. And sacrifice on any level too. Sacrificing meaning downgrading your lifestyle if you have to to get better results at whatever something something like somebody trying to figure out you know how to get you know in the city limits. I I don't know if I'm making sense, but somebody trying to figure out that that they need to downsize to get where they need to be or something. And and I gotta say this, I got a feeling somebody had given up on love, or even this couple, this woman had given up on love, and and, and this 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 guy caught her in the nick of time. It could be uh, a couple that remarried twice. This two of cups. There's there's been some type of struggle. And even though uh, the lady stands there, it, this is for the ones that's given a second chance. She, she, she still is the the uh, wands, the queen of wands, because she don't know if she can trust you. You did it once before. What ma what make uh, her think you won't do it again? Or he did it once before. What make you think he won't do it again? You know, type energy. But you know y'all meant to be together, but it ain't your fault. You know that he the fool and he can't see what's before him. So you let him bump his head. You smooth like that. Matter of fact, he taught you how to be that smooth, you know, so you don't care. But... Somebody maybe are, is going to come back and convince someone and, and, and be brand new to someone. Or this the person that might randomly meet this person, this is the type of person that they're going to be, like a forgiving person, a loving person. Like this, this, union, this union ain't about no money here. Both of them got money. Now, that doesn't mean money in always physical, you know, 5, 10, 15, 20, 100. It don't mean that 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 might be part of it, but that's not all of it. 
Like, like, like this couple here is in raw form. And this relationship or this marriage or, or whatever it is, it, it's in raw form. And they don't hide any secrets. They know each other's secrets. And so it's like this hawk, what is this lion or whatever, is up over them to make sure nobody bamboozles anybody. Oh, he's the referee of this thing. Because he knows in the flick of a hand by them living, this this couple living their life in the raw, like really, really, really knowing each other's dark, dirty, deep secrets. He know this can flip over to something real dangerous because it's too raw. Ain't no sugar on it or nothing. It's just straight up. So, for the month of December, we are dealing with sacrifice. And what else did I say we are dealing with? Y'all, y'all, y'all know how I get. So, 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 I have to say this too. If you are giving this king a wands a second chance, it's optional. It's up to you. You might have grown past him and feel like you can do better. But then he might come back and show you something you ain't ever seen before. You know, it 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 can go different ways, you know. But the choice going to be yours. I just know he's coming back. That's what I do know. Or I know he's came back and y'all remarrying or something. But if you take him back, he's going to be out of sight. But he's going to have insecurities because he knows that you've forgiven him, but you still see the vision. And ain't nothing he can do about that. So, yeah. For the month of December, you are going to be dealing with sacrificing. And I forgot what that other one was. So, y'all just, uh, this was a beautiful hand. Only thing I saw, oh, sacrifice and struggle. That's what you're going to be dealing with for the month of December. Sacrifice and struggle. Yep. Y'all get ready for it. Sacrifice and struggle. What do you have to sacrifice? What are you struggling with? Because you're going to be faced with it in December. So I didn't want this to slip up on you. And you not do your homework and study uh, this because that's what December is bringing, struggle and sacrifice. That That's what December is talking about. And, and may I add, uh, it's a bitter, cold struggle and sacrifice. But it's going to be well worth the payoff. You can do everything, but stop. Cookers closet. Mwah.